back. It is Friday, April 22nd. I don't know. It is third day of first period here in Wisconsin for turkey hunting. We uh, face paint 101. Face paint. Uh, that'd be our second outing. And what do you know? It's raining again. Shocker. Uh, we just can't seem to catch a break on the weather. Oh, well, we can. Just the nights we can't hunt. <laughs> but, uh, no, so we're heading back to the same blind, same location. We had, last night when we were sitting at our daughter's spring concert, we had, the camera was going off, the blind, the, uh, Tom's right in front of it again, of course. It's like they know when we're there. But, uh, we're hoping they don't seem boogered up at all, so we're just gonna go crawl back in. Yeah, it's raining, but at least tonight it's not... 40 mile an hour crazy winds like it was last time. So uh, we'll see what happens, but that's all we can do. I don't know. It's supposed to be real warm tomorrow, so if all else fails, we'll get a good morning hunt in tomorrow. So stay tuned.
Well, what happened, Jessica? Nothing good. Nothing good. When you expect the turkeys to come from one direction, you're facing that direction. And then they come out the opposite direction, 20 yards away. They shock you when you're not prepared. And then the whole game plan goes right up. That, that, my friends, is what happened today. Yep, that's pretty much right in a <laughs> nutshell. So, the group of birds that we've been watching here came out. 20 yards. Caught us off guard. No excuses, we kind of panicked. Um, I saw a big, big double beard in the group. I was trying to get her on that one. And she had a clear shot of another one right in front of me. that I didn't know. It was just, it was a cluster, we'll leave it at that. But uh, we went and we looked. I think she just ruffled up his feathers on his back. So, uh, on the bigger and better, as they say. <laughs> yeah.
You got him. Oh yeah. He done. You hammered him. Had a girl. Oh, you hammered him. Oh yeah. You jelly headed him. <laughs> wow. Well, when they decided to come in, they came in, huh? Oh gosh, yeah. Nervous. Look at this guy out here, he still wants to fight. <laughs> well, um, yeah, I don't think he has a head anymore. No, you took it off. What happened, Jessica? So, it's Sunday morning. Mike and I got set up and real early. We were like debating about the weather. Do we want to go out in the rain? As you can see, it's not raining. So we came out. We knew last night that there were birds here, so we figured this is a good place to go. And, um, I don't know. Sh shortly after legal shooting, we started hearing them gobble. Yeah. Yeah, they didn't start gobbling until like, I don't even know what time is it now. I don't know, 6. 6.03. Yeah, so they probably didn't start gobbling until... 5.30. Yeah, 5.30, 20 to, 20 to 6. So, I, I don't know, a hen flew down first, then two toms flew down, and they were over on the edge strutting. Then I was getting nervous thinking, the stinking hen's gonna pull them away from us. Well, because that one hen was taking them, was going way across the field. Then did you see that? When they started coming to us, she flew to them. Oh, she's the one that flew to them? Yep. I thought there was one from No, nope, she flew to them. Yeah. So she didn't really want them to come to us, which would probably have been good advice for him. <laughs> but, so we've got the Jake over the hen decoy, and they didn't like that at all. Well, it, so took them, came, it took them a little bit, but they finally yeah. came in and got mad at them. Enough time for me to calm down, which was good. <laughs> Um, so they came in and there was one strutting and one next to him and I took the one farther to the left because I had a better shot at it. Yeah, but, grab uh, your gun. Very excited. <laughs> it's the first turkey with the new uh, turkey slayer we set up for you and Rachel and Carly and all the rest of the girls. It's nice and short and compact. After missing earlier this week, this feels good. <laughs> Where's the carnage start? <laughs> Oh boy. Oh, you lost a tail feather. Oh no! He lost lots of feathers. For Sage. Yeah, he was an angry bird. Oh man, look at that head. You, t you tamale him. Check him out. Oh yeah. What's he got for spurs? Not bad. Mm -hmm. Three quarter or so. Mm -hmm. A nice thick beard on him, huh? Like Jessica said, it's Sunday morning. We had a pretty rough go of it this week, actually. We saw a lot of a lot of turkeys and uh, had a lot of action, but we just couldn't seem to connect. Last night we had a tom goblin and a, a little mishap with a neighbor firing up some machinery or something. But uh, no, I mean we played our cards right. We sat down last night with supper and we had a we each had a drink and we're sort of washing away all the bad <laughs> luck. We're starting over. And uh, that paid off. These two came charging in. They said they stood over there on the edge of what felt like, I mean, it wasn't that long, but it felt like forever. Literally. Strutting and gobbling. Forever. But once they finally had enough, they came in and the rest is history. So now we can get cleaned up and 
get out of here. It's just starting to rain. But uh I'll go show Sagey, she's probably still sleeping. Hope so. And then uh we can spend a nice little family day on Sunday here and relax a little. So stay tuned, more hunts to come. Take your thermosel out with you. Yeah, skeeters Jeez. are bad all of a sudden. One warm day. That's all they need. <laughs>